Japan's new strategy is blowing everyone's minds, and I'm here to show you the results. Today we're putting Japan's new strategy to the test to see if it's living up to the hype. With the current geopolitical landscape in flux, Japan is working to stay ahead of the curve and their newest approach has everyone talking. In this video, we'll dive into the details of this new strategy, explore the challenges it's meant to address, and examine whether it succeeded in its goals. From economic powerhouse to regional security leader, Japan is a nation that's constantly adapting to the changing world around it. As we explore this new strategy, you'll get a glimpse into the inner workings of Japan's policy-making machine and learn what drives their decisions on the global stage. By the end of this video, you'll have a clear understanding of Japan's vision for its future and whether this new strategy is the key to achieving it. Japan is a country that's deeply invested in its relationships with other nations, and this new strategy is no exception. With great power comes great responsibility, and Japan's leaders are working to balance their national interests with their global obligations. As we delve into the details of this strategy, keep an eye out for the ways in which Japan is positioning itself as a leader in the region and beyond. So, what can you expect from this video? We'll take a deep dive into the specifics of Japan's new strategy, exploring the challenges it's meant to address and the ways in which it differs from past approaches. Along the way, we'll examine the key decisions and turning points that have shaped the strategy's success or failure. By the end of this video, you'll have a comprehensive understanding of Japan's new strategy and its implications for the nation's future. With all that said, let's get started. Japan faces a unique set of challenges that have necessitated this new strategy. From an aging population to a rapidly changing security landscape, Japan's leaders are working to address a complex web of economic, social and security issues. The nation's economy, once the second largest in the world, has been feeling the effects of stagnation in recent years. One of the key challenges Japan faces is its declining population. With a rapidly aging society, the workforce is shrinking and the government is struggling to balance the social security system. This demographic shift is also having a profound impact on the nation's economy, as fewer working-age citizens means fewer consumers and a shrinking tax base. Another challenge Japan faces is the rapidly changing security landscape in East Asia. With North Korea's nuclear program and China's growing military presence, Japan is working to maintain a delicate balance of power in the region. This has led to increased tensions with its neighbors and a corresponding increase in defense spending. In addition to these security concerns, Japan is also grappling with the impact of globalization on its economy. With trade tensions on the rise and protectionist sentiment growing worldwide, Japan's leaders are working to diversify their trade relationships and reduce their reliance on exports. Furthermore, Japan's energy security is another pressing concern. The nation is heavily dependent on imported fossil fuels, which has led to concerns about energy security and the environmental impact of its energy sector. The nation's infrastructure is also in need of an overhaul. From aging roads and bridges to insufficient internet connectivity, Japan's infrastructure is struggling to keep pace with the demands of the 21st century. Another challenge Japan faces is the need to revitalize its regions. Many of Japan's rural areas are facing declining populations and economies, and the government is working to stimulate growth and development in these regions. In addition to these economic challenges, Japan is also working to address a range of social issues. The nation's education system is facing pressure to adapt to the changing needs of the workforce, and there are concerns about the mental health and well-being of its citizens. Are you enjoying the video? If yes, please subscribe, like and share our videos for more exciting content. Let's continue. The nation's healthcare system is also under strain, with a shortage of medical professionals and a growing burden on the social security system. Japan's leaders are also working to address the nation's environmental challenges. From climate change to pollution, the government is taking steps to reduce the nation's environmental impact. Furthermore, Japan's tourism industry is booming, but the nation is struggling to balance the benefits of tourism with the need to preserve its cultural heritage. The nation's agriculture sector is also facing challenges, with a shortage of young farmers and a growing reliance on imported food. In response to these challenges, Japan's leaders have developed a comprehensive new strategy that aims to address the nation's economic, social and security issues. This strategy is built around a range of key components, from economic revitalization to security cooperation. At its core, the new strategy is focused on stimulating economic growth and increasing Japan's competitiveness on the global stage. This involves a range of initiatives, from deregulation and market liberalization to investment in cutting-edge technology and innovation. 
One of the key components of the strategy is the development of a more robust social security system. This includes expanding childcare services, increasing support for the elderly, and promoting work-life balance. The strategy also places a strong emphasis on human capital development, with a focus on education and training programs that equip Japan's workforce with the skills they need to succeed in the 21st century. In terms of security, the new strategy takes a more proactive approach to regional security cooperation. This includes increased defense spending as well as cooperation with like-minded nations to address common security challenges. The strategy also prioritizes regional revitalization with a focus on stimulating growth and development in Japan's rural areas. Another key component of the strategy is the promotion of sustainable development. This includes initiatives to reduce Japan's environmental impact as well as investments in renewable energy and green technology. In addition, the strategy places a strong emphasis on cultural exchange and international cooperation. This includes initiatives to promote Japanese culture abroad, as well as cooperation with other nations on issues like disaster relief and humanitarian assistance. So how does this strategy differ from past approaches? One of the key differences is its focus on proactive regional security cooperation. In the past, Japan has taken a more passive approach to regional security, but this new strategy recognizes the need for more proactive engagement. Another key difference is the emphasis on human capital development. Past approaches have focused primarily on economic growth, but this new strategy recognizes the importance of investing in education and training programs that equip Japan's workforce with the skills they need to succeed. The strategy also takes a more holistic approach to development, recognizing the interconnectedness of economic, social and security issues. This represents a significant shift from past approaches, which have often siloed these issues into separate policy domains. A pivotal moment in the implementation of this strategy came when the Japanese government made the decision to increase defense spending and expand its military presence in the region. This move marked a significant shift in Japan's security posture and has had a profound impact on the nation's relationships with its neighbors. Another key moment came when the government launched a major initiative to stimulate growth and development in Japan's rural areas. This included investments in infrastructure, as well as programs to promote regional revitalization and stimulate entrepreneurship. So, has Japan's new strategy succeeded? Based on the evidence presented, it's clear that the strategy has had some significant successes. The nation's economy is growing and its security relationships with its neighbors are improving. However, there are still challenges ahead. The nation's demographics remain a pressing concern and the government is struggling to balance its budget. Despite these challenges, it's clear that Japan's new strategy has put the nation on a path towards long-term growth and development. The key to its success will be continued implementation and adaptation to changing circumstances. Thanks for watching. If you want to learn more about Japan's new strategy and its implications for the nation's future, be sure to check out our video on Japan's economic miracle. Don't forget to like and subscribe for more videos on international strategies and global affairs. Subscribe to Revo now and join our vibrant community of forward thinkers, change makers, and revolutionaries.